Thomas. That's funny. This file says Frank Lee. If you disobey the rules of society, they send you to prison. If you disobey the rules of the prison, they send you to us. Now, Alcatraz is not like any other prison in the United States. Here, every inmate is confined alone to an individual cell. Unlike my predecessors, Wardens Johnson and Blackwell, I don't have good conduct programs. I do not have inmate councils. Inmates here have no say in what they do. They do as they're told. You're not permitted to have newspapers or magazines carrying news. Knowledge of the outside world is uh, what we tell you. From this day on, your world will be everything that happens in this building. You will shave once a day. You will shower twice a week. You cut your hair once a month. Now, the privileges. You can talk. You can work. Other institutions hand out work. But here, it's a privilege that you have to earn. I promise you, it's a privilege that you'll want. Visitors, you're allowed two a month. They cannot be former inmates of this or any other federal prison. All names that you submit will be carefully checked by the FBI. What names do you have in mind? I can't think of any offhand. Family members? None. No family. Alcatraz is a maximum security prison with very few privileges. We don't make good citizens but we make good prisoners. Burglary, armed robbery, grand larceny. You've escaped from quite a few prisons, haven't you? That's why you're here. Alcatraz was built to keep all the rotten eggs in one basket. And I was specially chosen to make sure that the stink from the basket does not escape. Since I've been warden, a few people have tried to escape. Uh, most of them have been recaptured. Those that haven't have been killed or drowned in the bay. No one has ever escaped from Alcatraz. 